and welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And on the menu, live action from the Zweite Bundesliga. It's Hannover, and they take on Darmstadt. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Here's the starting 11 for Hannover. Well, in this shape, unless their wing backs play further forward, there won't be any width in their attacks, which then puts a lot of pressure on the strikers to provide the goal threat. This is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, in this formation, the wide centre-backs need to be good all-round players, both in possession and defensively. They have to defend the box and also get out into the wide areas to cover the wing-backs. And now they get the ball rolling. Braden Manu. Good strength to keep the ball. Very quick thinking there. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Well, the stats are there for all to see. The visiting side with the best defensive record in the league, and they do it with relish. Well, they've been so hard to break down this season, and key to that has been the centre-back combinations. They've looked so assured, they've been excellent right from the start. Now, well, nothing comes of it. Blocked it brilliantly, and the keeper more than equal to the task. But oh, he's gone short with it. Firing it towards goal. Oh, excellent diving stop. <laughs> Elects to go short. Karic still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead but not forcing it and a foul in the opinion of the referee now what can they do from this free kick situation and a yellow card it's going to be Stewart yeah the ref's got that right it's a yellow card all day long But the keeper able to turn it away. A stunning stop. Oh, 
Well, they fancy a short one. And blocked for now. Growing pressure here, and another corner. Let's see about the delivery. As a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. And offside. Well, close one. Cedric Teichert. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Really important piece of last ditch defending. Counter attacking, very much an option. Opportunity. The save was a good one. And over comes the corner. Not the best clearance. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Cedric Teichert. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. The goal to put them in front. And there's a turn up for the books based on what we've seen in this game so far. Just look at this, he's so alive to the situation. That's a neat-headed goal in the end. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. And the referee blows for a foul. Well cleared away. It is a decent looking attack here. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Has a go. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Well, opting for the short corner. Makes the move to the inside. Schnellhardt. It's Melem. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. It's looking promising takes the shot and a fantastic diving save <laughs> a 
And over it comes. And he failed to get it away properly. And I think the threat has been averted. So that will be all for the first half here in Hannover. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. He's in control of the situation. A chance to whip it in. And across the touchline, so a throw in here. And time for the change now. Is this the moment? He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it. And just look at that strike. He opens up his body and makes a really clean contact with the ball. A great finish. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Bada. Here's Fabian Schnellhardt. And behind it's gone for a corner. Going for the short one. It's a perfect challenge. That is how to apply the pressure. Bodies forward and the break looks on. A disappointing end to the move. Honzak. It's Melem. Philip Tietz. No danger here as he runs at them. Not all that convincing defensively. The delivery. Not the best clearance. And he takes it on. Superb block. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Could reduce the deficit. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Trying to deliver it accurately. The clearance wasn't decisive. Chance to reduce the arrears. And thumped away.
takes the shot. Making sure it didn't get past him. Can he play it in? Top class defending. Cedric Teuchert. Can they hit on the break? Well, that is how to break up a counter-attack. Can he get one back? Still possibilities. Oh, a tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Playing it short. Zimmerman. Yannick Müller here. Pressing high to win the ball. Body in the way. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, it petered out. Philip Tietz. Spot on with that tackle. Throw-ins given. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. And that is going to be that. Well, a tale of woe in terms of the scoreline as far as the visitors are concerned here. Well, that's not what I expected. They're usually so hard to play against. But when your forwards stop closing the ball down and your midfield players get outplayed, then it's so much harder for the defence. And that's what's happened today. 